Good morning and welcome to Island Adventures. Another trip to the Columbus Zoo, so let's go. Like Ed said, we're back here at the Columbus Zoo, one of our very favorite places. And because we are members, today's visit is free. So today we're gonna try and do some of our favorite things. We'll probably check out Heart of Africa, maybe the polar bears, maybe see the baby elephant, a sea lion show. Who knows? But let's go see some animals. Valerie's having trouble today vlogging. She's not feeling it today. <laughs> I'm, I'm finding my groove. It's been a few weeks. It only took her about 15 times to do the introduction, folks, <laughs> but that's okay. She'll be all right. Meanwhile, we're walking up to the entrance of the Columbus Zoo. So let's go. If you watched our last video of the Columbus Zoo that we did, we were first in line. Well, not so much today. We are slacking today. So Valerie and I are going to make our way over to Adventure Cove, the newest attraction here at the Columbus Zoo, because we wanted to see when the sea lion show is. So I'm gonna go check it out. Valerie is power walking. Go Val, go. Sea lion shows are at 12 and at two. It's 10 o'clock. We can make it maybe. Eh. We'll see. <laughs> Usually, we'll, usually we don't stay at the zoo more than two hours. So we'll see what happens today. Meanwhile, let's go somewhere else. Since it is October 2nd, the zoo is decorated for Halloween. Can you hear the spooky music? Ooh. Here are the Mexican wolf. They are out and about. I just want to pet one. You said you want to pet one? I want to pet one. You might get bit. No. I don't think it would like eat me though, right? Could. Just a little bite. You might look delicious. <laughs> Valerie would call them spooky flamingos. I would call them Halloween flamingos. Choo-choo! Oh, Valerie said she spotted something. Let's see what it might be. It's a Canada lynx. Once again, what is it? It's a Canada lynx. Right there. It's a threatened species. Heading into Polar Frontier because Valerie wants to see. I want to see Kulu, the like two year old male. He's going to move to another zoo later this fall. So I'm hoping he's out today. That's him. So Kulu's in the back. His mother is on the left. And front and on the right is the mama. Did you get that? <laughs> <laughs> They said when he's going to move? No. Yeah. No, no. Cute and cuddly. He's so cute and cuddly. I want an Arctic fox. So we only found one brown bear. 
here's the other one. They called him Brutus and Buckeye, and rightly so, because we're in the great state of the Buckeyes. Brutus and Buckeye were born in Alaska and they were orphaned in 2004 and then they came to the Columbus Zoo so now they're Buckeyes. Now heading into the heart of Africa which contains Valerie's favorite animal the giraffe. That is a rarity that we see him up and walking around. Yeah, he's usually laying somewhere asleep when we come. That was cool. Ed's excited. He gets to see his weirdo favorite. Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce you to the ostrich. Coming up on the cheetahs. Oh, look at them. They're staring right at us. Well, one of them is. <laughs> Strike a pose. All right, Valerie's favorite animal. Let's go feed him. There's no line. Okay. Let's go. Well, the boss has spoken. She wants to feed him, so we're going to go feed him. Those are the babies over there. This is Zuri right here. Wants that lettuce. Awesome. You too. Okay, so you saw me feed Zuri for like 10 seconds. Went really quick. It's fun, cool. It's only $3, definitely worth doing. But we're kind of spoiled because this spring we went to the wilds and did the wild side tour. You get to feed the giraffes tons. You get to pet them, take pictures. It's really amazing. So if you love giraffes like I do, we highly recommend the wilds wild side tour. And watch that video. Scroll back and watch the video. Bunch of giraffes out today. some zebras back there. And gazelles. So a lot of room out here for them to roam around. Valerie. Yes. I don't remember 
seeing this many drafts out at one time here at the Columbus Zoo. I agree, there are a lot of drafts. I kind of wonder, because normally we come at nine, the zoo opens at nine and we're back here quick. The zoo opened at 10 now that it's October. And I feel like things are different, so maybe more giraffes are out later. I don't know. There were a ton of giraffes out today. The vervet monkeys. Camel rides for your little kitties here at the Columbus Zoo. Exiting the heart of Africa. Now let's make our way over to see some reindeers, hopefully. The moose is out right now. really big animal. He is. Fun story, I went to Finland in 2019 with my cousin Emily and she kept hoping we would see one when we were driving. I was not hoping that. <laughs> Let's go see some elephants, or at least one elephant for right now. This is a rare occurrence. Hardly ever see the sloth bear. Never this close. Never this close for sure. Ooh, look how long his claws are. Mean claws. Oh, but he's so sweet looking. What are we doing now? We're gonna go see the baby elephant Frankie. He was born in June, so he's like eh, three and a half months old. So last time we were here, we didn't stand in line to see the baby elephant, so now we're gonna go see the baby elephant. Looks like he's outside today. Baby elephant viewing straight ahead. Let's go. Coming up on the red panda, another one of Valerie's favorite here at the zoo. I have a lot of favorites. <laughs> They're usually hiding up in the trees. Let's see if we can find them today. Yeah. At least now that it's fall, there's less leaves to hide them. I uh, can't see them. Can't see them right there? I mean, I can see them. Oh, but okay. I don't Not know if our, I don't think our audience can see them. Gotcha. See if we can get a better view. I'm pointing right at him. We could see him clearly, but I know it's kind of hard to see on camera. Another 
Snoozing. At least we can see them. We haven't seen a tiger in the last several visits. Valerie and I are making our way back over to Adventure Cove to see some sea lions and some seals. Now we're heading up top to see the sea lions and seals from above. Well, that's going to do it for us here at the Columbus Zoo today. What do you think, babe? I think we had a good time. I got to see Kulu, the polar bear, one last time before he leaves. We fed the giraffes, probably for the last time this year, because right. they'll go inside for the winter. Um, we saw the sea lions and seals. We didn't see the show. I think what we're going to do one day is just come just for the show, because right. it's a little later in the day than we're normally here. Um, but otherwise, oh, we saw uh, the brown bear eating food. That was cool, and the lion was walking around. It was a really good day. <laughs> All right, and as always, thanks for watching our videos, and we'll see you on the next adventure. Bye.